It's Tuesday, April 29th, 2014. I'm Janice Kimoka, and this is DX Daily. A press conference by the NBA took place today to address Los Angeles Clippers owner Donald Sterling's racist comments. The result? NBA Commissioner Adam Silver announced that Donald Sterling is banned for life and that he will be fined $2.5 million for racist remarks that were audio taped. Commissioner Silver also announced that he is going to try to force Sterling to sell the team. Many rappers have responded to the NBA's decision to ban Sterling for life, including Killer Mike, Jada Kiss, Freddie Gibbs, and more. Freddie tweeted that Magic Johnson should buy the Clippers, and Killer Mike tweeted, if you think banning an 80-year-old man for life is in some way a win for black people, one, don't speak on my behalf, and two, kill yourself. For more reactions on the NBA's final decision, head on over to the site. Stat Quo recently sat down with Hip Hop DX for an exclusive interview. The rapper revealed that 50 Cent's beats on Get Rich or Die Trying were originally for Rakim. When asked more in depth about it, Stat shared that the hooks were the problem. He says, the choruses were never strong. He's a dope ass rapper, but right now, can you remember a Rakim hook? He also goes on to say that the reason Rakim didn't come out with an album on Aftermath was because he couldn't come up with hooks. The former Shady Aftermath MC also explains why Slaughterhouse hasn't sold millions of records and talks about reconciling with Dr. Dre. To read what else that quote had to say, make sure you check out the full interview. Rihanna shows plenty of skin in her latest magazine cover. The singer goes topless on the cover of French magazine Lou. Adorned with just a body chain and nipple rings, Rihanna sits back and lightly attempts to cover the goods in the cover that was photographed by Mario Sorrenti. The rest of the photos were also racy, with Rihanna showing off her prominent tan lines by the pool, wearing only a pair of mint heels. The magazine should be hitting newsstands soon. Those are today's top headlines. For more music and news, log on to hiphopdx.com.